Well, now we continue with your workbooks. Please open your workbooks to the unit number eight, because today we are starting the unit eight. So page number 51. Are you there? If you're not, make a pause and open your workbook. Okay, so the unit eight has the same name as the students' books. So this is girls and boys. Here. We have this part, have to, affirmative, negative, and question. Here you have this verb with the next word that this is infinitive, have to play, do you have to do in affirmative and negative form. So you are going to complete the interview with a professional soccer player, Tony Mancini, using the lines in the box that you have here. Have to be, remember, have to run, and it has to be, has to run, have to play, do you have to do, doesn't have to watch, have to watch. So, uh, read carefully and don't forget the second verb doesn't change. Recuerden si es que tienen que cambiar a have o has, se mantiene así. Aquí incluso ya ni, no tienen que cambiar nada porque ya el verbo está conjugado. Se fijan, acá hay I don't, a veces hay doesn't, so fíjense bien al momento de completar. Cuando terminen de completar esta página, es uno para cada uno nomás, no se repite, eh, van a hacer esa parte de aquí. He is Tony Mancini. You are going to complete using have to. So, if this is interrogative, aquí ya no están las opciones que tenemos acá. Así que ustedes tienen que poner el auxiliar de la pregunta do o does. Y el verbo have to, como son preguntas, todas van a ser con have to, ninguna va a cambiar a has to. Has to solo es para he, she, o it, nada más. Okay. Complete this, when you finish this, take a picture of the complete page and send this page to the WhatsApp group. Okay.